It is hot and steamy tonight as Father's Day comes to a close. What can we expect for our Monday? Let's get a check of the forecast with meteorologist Lauren Casey. Hey, Lauren. Hey, Joe. Well, we'll expect hotter and even steamier conditions as we head into the upcoming week, the first week of the summer season. But it was certainly a better afternoon and evening to get out and about with Dad to celebrate his day with a quieter weather day, although we did have some slow-moving downpours, spotty in nature that did pop up mainly over South Jersey. All is now quiet as we get a live look at Storm Scan 3. Not too much going on, a few passing clouds, and we will again see some areas of fog developing as we head into the overnight period that could reduce visibilities locally but getting a live look at center city philadelphia we are mostly clear and quiet as we close out this father's day weekend temperatures still quite warm at 74 degrees in philadelphia still mid 70s in the lehigh valley upper 70s across berks county and low 70s right now down the shore under a clear sky two points they tell us how muggy it feels when you step outside and they have been in the mid to upper 60s for the last several days and that's where they will remain for the day tomorrow before crossing that 70 degree threshold. Once they do that, it starts to feel like that Florida style humidity as we head into tonight. Partly cloudy, mild and muggy with low temperature only falling back to near 70 degrees with those areas of fog developing late tonight on our comfort index as we head into the day tomorrow, feeling kind of similar humidity wise to today. And then as I mentioned, we push up into the excessive category as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday, and we'll combine that with high temperatures in the low 90s. And tomorrow we will jump up to 90 degrees. It will be the start of the season's first heat wave, mostly sunny with a few hit or miss thunderstorms as we head into the afternoon and evening. So not everyone seeing storm activity tomorrow. They won't be widespread in coverage, but of the storms that do develop, one or two do have the potential to become severe in our marginal risk category. That's one out of five through the day tomorrow mainly west of I-76 and across portions of Delaware. So keep aware to the evolving weather tomorrow afternoon and evening. Future weather showing us quiet into the overnight period, mostly sunny through much of the day tomorrow. A few showers popping into the early afternoon hours, then a better chance at a few showers, downpours and thunderstorms. But you can see they're mainly concentrated well off to our west where better dynamics are in place. But we still could see a few storms sneaking on in. Then especially as we head after sunset, that storm threat will diminish but again returning as we head into Tuesday afternoon and evening. More widespread in coverage on Tuesday. High temperature at 92. Check out that low by Wednesday morning, 74. Best chance of storms is on Wednesday, Joe, as a cold front moves across the area and gives us a break at least from some of that humidity on Thursday and Friday. Dry conditions, but still hot with highs in the upper 80s. That's one hot week there, Lauren. Thank you so yeah. much.